uh, for 30 years, I believe, they have created these citations. And um, it's a great um, testament to, to the work that you've done for us and the great work that you've done for our state. So thank you very much. Sir. Thank you. It is indeed a pleasure to join all of you today um, as we celebrate the accomplishments of these three gentlemen who have spent their lifetime passing on the ideals and beliefs and um, just cherishing Wisconsin's <coughs> natural resources um, to the next generation. And I think that today's celebration uh, is very much needed, especially during these times when we know that there are some challenges both at the state and national level when it comes to preserving and carefully managing um, our natural resources. So this citation um, says, whereas every year the Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame conducts a select group of individuals into the Hall of Fame to recognize the important contributions each has made to the resource management in the state. And whereas Professor Randall Koshashek has been chosen as a 2015 Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame inductee for his lifelong commitment to our state's natural resources. And whereas Ronald has had a long and fruitful teaching career at Regents High School in Eau Claire, Dartmouth College, and eventually serving as professor of philosophy, ethics, and jurisprudence at the University of Eau Claire, uh, until 1999, when he retired as Professor Emeritus, and whereas Ronald founded the Ojibwe uh, chapter of Trout Unlimited in 1972, where he worked as president to combat the decline of trout stream environments through various habitat restoration projects, and served from 1976 to 1979 as one of two Wisconsin representatives on the National Board of Trout Unlimited. And whereas Ronald continued to be active in conserving Wisconsin streams by petitioning in numerous cases to protect water quality and curb erosion, erosion and pollution by development projects, and was named Wisconsin Wildlife Federation's Conservationist of the Year in 1984 for his efforts. And whereas Ronald was appointed to the Citizen Advisory Committee and in 1981 became the organization's chairman, where he traveled throughout Wisconsin to speak with citizens who believed their public rights were not being adequately protected and advised them on how to advocate for their concerns with the Office of Public Interview, resulting in several cases that moved public policy significantly towards a conservation ethic, such as local pesticide regulations in the town of Casey. And whereas as a member of the Town of Howard Planning Commission and as a public citizen, Ronald has worked to develop model legislation to manage the industrial silica sand mining industry in western Wisconsin and advocate for higher standards and monitoring requirements for crystalline silica contamination. Now therefore, Senator Julie Lassa and Representative Katrina Shankman do hereby honor Professor Ronald Kashashek for his lifelong efforts to inspire greater appreciation and stewardship of Wisconsin's natural resources and his leadership as a conservationist who uses his appreciation and deep understanding of our natural resources to preserve our proud natural heritage and outdoor heritage and unique wild places. that celebrates our conservation traditions um, is this event. It's so inspiring to be in a room full of people who are our state's heavy lifters. So I thank you all from the bottom of my heart for what you do for our state and our natural resources. So I'm honored to present this citation, uh, Know You By These Presents. Whereas every year the Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame inducts a select group of individuals into the Hall of Fame to recognize the important contributions each has made to resource management in the state. And whereas Eugene Rourke has been chosen as a 2015 Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame inductee for his lifelong commitment to our state's natural resources and
and his dedication to teaching others respect and responsibility for the conservation of land and wildlife. And whereas Jean was born in Madison, Wisconsin in 1931 and developed an appreciation for the natural world at an early age. And whereas Jean graduated from the University of Wisconsin-Madison with a degree in conservation journalism and began his career in 1960 with the Wisconsin Conservation Department, after which he worked as the State Director of Tourism until 1978. And whereas Jean joined the Madison Audubon Society as a teenager in the 1940s and helped found the Wisconsin chapter of the Nature Conservancy in 1960, where he served as a board member and board chairman and an active emeritus trustee. And whereas, Jean has been a member of the Natural Heritage Land Trust since 1992 and has held leadership roles as a board member, secretary of the board, and a longtime member of the stewardship committee, providing advice about selecting conservation projects, getting to know land owners, and always looking to the future. And whereas, Jean is one of the founding members of the Invasive Plants Association of Wisconsin and has chaired the organization's government relations committee where he provided feedback to decision makers on policy issues relating to invasive plants. And whereas, Jean has held leadership roles in a number of other conservation organizations, including the Wisconsin Society for Ornithology, the Dane County Conservation League, the Wisconsin Woodland Owners Association, and the board of the Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame, and has contributed his time and talent to at least 58 other conservation groups. And whereas, Jean has provided a voice for these conservation groups in the legislature and continues to use his contacts in the forestry community and in state government to advocate for public conservation funding and good natural resource policy. And whereas, Jean and his wife have led by example by planting thousands of trees on their properties in Columbia and Richland County and by enrolling their land on Lake Wisconsin in the Managed Forest Land Program and in a conservation easement with the Natural Heritage Land Trust. Now, therefore, State Senator Julie Lassa and Representative Katrina Shanklin do hereby honor Eugene Rourke for his lifelong commitment to the land, its natural resources, and his critical role in connecting various conservation interests to preserve Wisconsin's natural landscape. conducts a select group of individuals into the Hall of Fame to recognize the important contributions each has made to resource management in the state. And whereas David A. Ladd has been chosen as a 2015 Wisconsin Conservation Hall of Fame inductee for his lifelong commitment to our state's natural resources and his obligation to teaching others respect and responsibility for the conservation of land and wildlife. And whereas Dave was born and raised on a farm near Dodgeville, Wisconsin, and has lived in this region for his entire life, where he first learned from his father that caring for the land, waterways, and wildlife of the area was the only way to provide for family and for future generations. Whereas Dave used his lessons and wisdom of his father to teach gun safety classes through the Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources for 20 years, where he instilled the same sense of respect for Mother Nature in over 1,000 children and was awarded the DNR's Outstanding Volunteer of Wisconsin Award for his dedication. And whereas in 1972, Dave founded Walnut Hollow Inc., which is a woodcraft manufacturing company that is environmentally friendly and has planted over 300,000 trees on their private land and has donated trees to the city of Dodgeville for downtown revitalization, for which he received the Distinguished Service Award from the Wisconsin Urban Forestry Council and Trees USA. And whereas Dave also worked to establish the Wisconsin Woodland Owners Association and the Iowa County <coughs> Recreation and Prairie Restoration Project, and was appointed as the Vice Chair of Governor Thompson's Knowles Nelson Blue Ribbon Task Force and was elected to the Wisconsin Conservation Congress in District 9 for 40 years. And whereas Dave has received countless awards for his dedication to the conservation and preservation of our natural resources, including the Appreciation Award from the Wisconsin Chapter of the Walnut Council, U.S. Small, US Small Business Administration's Wisconsin Small Business Person of the Year Award, the Habitat Landowner Award through the DNR's Bureau of Endangered Resources, the DNR's Bureau of Wildlife Management Special Service Award, 
the Wildlife Habitat Club Award from the Iowa County Land Committee, DNR's Law Enforcement Certificate of Appreciation, the 2000 Milwaukee Journal Sentinel Sports Show Hall of Fame Award, the Distinguished Service Award from the Wisconsin Urban Forestry Council, the Pheasants Forever Award for Habitat Cooperation, the Award of Merit from the Wisconsin State Chapter of Trout Unlimited, the Conservationist of the Year Award from the Wisconsin Wildlife Federation, the Gathering Waters Conservancy Conservationist Lifetime Achievement Award, and the Conservation Achievement Award from the Natural Resources Foundation. Now therefore, Senator Julie Lawson and Representative Katrina Shanklin do hereby honor David A. Ladd for his long, lifelong efforts to inspire greater appreciation and stewardship of Wisconsin's natural resources and his leadership as a small business owner and conservationist who uses his knowledge and business to help preserve and enhance our outdoor heritage. time to come to today's performances and to today's performance of the induction ceremony and also to for reading and preparing the uh, citations. Um, they need to leave to go to another place. Ron, I'm wondering if you would take a minute to get a picture of the two of them with one of the citations in the in the lobby. Sure. At least we'll have a picture of that for our newsletter and to post on online. Thank you very much.